Welcome to video four in the series all about HPV. So far we've talked about what HPV is, how do you get it, how long have you had it, what cancers are caused by it. Next I'm going to talk about how HPV is treated. Today I'll talk about treatments for low risk HPV and in video five I'll go through how high risk HPV is treated. Dr. Kathy at your cervix here. If you've hung out at this channel at all, you'll know that I'm trying to make sense out of women's health care for you so that you can become a healthier you. 90% of genital warts are caused by the low risk HPV, HPV 6 and 11. Condyloma acuminata or genital warts are the most common sexually transmitted disease in the US. That means low risk to cause cervical cancer. In video one, I went through how HPV is typed. I'm going to discuss three ways to treat low risk HPV. Treatment number one, Studies have shown that if you do nothing, meaning that you don't treat at all, 30 to 40 percent of genital warts will go away on their own. Treatment number two, I will talk about medical therapies that you or your doctor can apply. I'll talk about what the medicine is, how it's used, and how does it work against the HPV virus. The first one is Aldera. You put it on three times a week for up to 16 weeks. How it works is it stimulates your immune system to kill the HPV virus. If you watch the next video on treating high-risk HPV, you'll hear me discuss Aldera again. The second one is Pedophilix. It's a solution or gel that you put on. You put it on three days, four days off, for up to four weeks. It works by destroying the skin of the wart. Number three is Vergen. It's an ointment. It is mainly used for immunocompromised patients. And the fourth medicine that you can use is TCA, and that destroys the proteins of the virus. TCA is applied by the doctor. This is what I typically use in the office. And the third is surgical removal of the wart, which your doctor can do. I wouldn't recommend that you do that yourself. They can use cryotherapy with liquid nitrogen or a cryoprobe, and that freezes the wart. Or they can excise it with scissors, shaving it, using a curette to scrape it. You can see what a curette looks like. It's a metal instrument with a curved edge. They can also use laser to remove it. The gift is that 70 to 90% of new HPV infections have spontaneous remission or become undetectable within two years. Now to the Howl of Hope. Behind you are all of your memories. Before you are all of your dreams. Around you are all who love you. Within you is all you need. In the next video, video five, I'll discuss treatment of high-risk HPV. If you've liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you don't wanna miss any videos on HPV or women's healthcare topic, please hit subscribe. And thanks so much for watching.